Hello, my name is Alan Gregan. I am Sired Harrison Driver for Alfie Bourne Agricontractor, Kildavan County Carlow. We're here today in the sunny southeast at the starting of the 2019 silage season. Well, behind me is our new silage harvester, a Chrome BX 530. Shawnee after arriving this morning, I finished this field here, going ready to go to the next field. And he was repl he replaced a similar 530 Chrome silage harvester after three successful seasons. And hopefully the new one will go as very as well as the last one did. She never let us down, never had a problem. Great backup service and sales from Jim Power Agri Sales. Sale, a mechanic is up there doing a bit of uh, setting up at the moment now, ready for the next field. This is our second 530, the original 530 we replaced an 850 class, which we ran for seven years. Very successful, lovely machine. The Crow one now, they have a few nice things that are really over the class. They have the extra feed rollers, which is very makes it very smooth. Um, you have a very comfortable cab. Everything is literally everything can be done for the cab. Chop, lent, speed, everything. If you have an absolutely terrible manoeuvrable machine, you turn around anywhere compared to it. And your average in that one is only, you know, she would be only a baby X compared to some of the big ones. She's 530 horsepower, average in 12 to 15 acres an hour. Diesel all depends on how wet or dry the crop was. Last year was a very good year. And they would have the edge on the class because a little bit more power than the class we had. And on, on the whole, the reason we ch he changed was just got a good deal and just few extras are on the class, are standard on the Crown. And when you put them all side by side, then the Crown was better value, better deal. This field was mowed last, yesterday by Alfie with his 724 Fent and his B1000 Butterfly Crown mowers. And he came along this morning and then with his class rake and fent tractor and raked the hop. And I picked up then with the new big X. And then he has a fleet of mostly class tractors with 22 foot broken silage trailers. I know there's a Valtra and a John Deere here today, but that's just an exception. And then on the pit, we have a Volvo L60H. She's on her way up here now. We're here on the 20th of April now, and this is the start of our silage. This is the first of the silage and this it's his own, this is Alfie's own grass and hopes to get about four cuts, probably five if the weather comes good. It was an early spring so he got the fertilizer out and there was no frost so he got a good growing season. I'm not quite sure I didn't add up what tonnage or anything came off the field but it was a good crop and he'll probably get slurry on this now and fertilizer seed and we'll get ready now for another five or six weeks and we'll get another cut off it. And this is all for dairy cows. Um, now when Alfie bought the original horse, I spec her on 900 tyres on the front and 710s on the back, which makes her fairly wide overall. But still, she's every bit as manoeuvrable as the harvester she replaced. And we've never got bet anywhere yet going in. But still, wider gates would be a help. Uh, you can't beat the room. Or last year he bought a brand new whole crop head to go on her to extend the season. So we do a nice little bit of whole crop. Uh, right after, the four, between the first and second cup we usually do the, the whole crop and then after the harvest we have a maize head to go on her as well. Uh, she's a very tall machine and it really helps when the farmers cut down the boughs and widen the gateways to make life a bit easier for us. And let's hope for another good year like last year with good weather.